Right, okay, just a little demo. Um, just burnt a version of my Stuntman game to uh, a ROM chip, which I've got in there. Uh, can't remember where I got that from. Retroelectronic.com. Um, so I've burnt that on there just uh, to test it running. Uh, I've got not much game logic in there. Um, I've got sort of crashing and things, and I've got to adjust brightness and things like that. But here we go. Let's let's see how khaki it looks. There's no sound either, which is obviously a key component to this. So it's now called Stuntman, not Stunt Cycle, because I'm going to have more than one mode, even though the title screen is still the same. That's uh, a little bit bright, so let's get off of that and go to the game. So here's the game. Five buses is my default at the minute. So I press the four button to accelerate. I've not put a um, wheelie crash mechanic in or anything like that yet. Uh, successfully jump, it'll increase the buses. So I need sound to see how much the engine's revving because you don't tell the user what the speed is. I'm dabbing the old button. It's uh, it's pretty stable apart from a little bit of wobble I've got on during the buses. Um, I don't know how to fix that. Oh, I don't. I haven't the knowledge to fix that yet. So I need to do some sort of weird adjustment, I think, to try and counteract. The uh, play of the game. Okay, so that's where it's at. I've got so I'm gonna have a mess about now and implement um, calculating the jump success and um, probably putting the acceleration, you know, too much acceleration crash code in as well. And then that's probably about finished for that there are issues because it's not i'm not catching the uh, going off screen properly but i don't bother about that i'll sort that in a minute okay so i've got pause implemented so that was one really good thing so if i press the two button pause is it <laughs> bit lame <laughs> but i was quite impressed that i got a pause working and i can quit back to the title screen okay so that's stunt cycle which is now stunt man Thank you very much.